So I'm taking my freezer paper off and you can see the very bottom of it has this mold there and I'm just going to kind of get to the corner here. This is still rather pliable. It's not super hard. And grab a hold of this end. And give it a pull. And that's what the bottom looks like. Isn't that cool? They aren't perfect, um, but I really like the look of this. And I will cut them on their side here um, so that they're more elongated pieces. They're like a tall and skinny piece. Now I'm going to cut them. They are rather um, soft, but I'm going to go ahead and cut them and come down through, hold on to it. got a drag mark through it. Look at this. Isn't that cool? It's like a piece of cheese, but I'm not going to eat it. And then there's a bit of a drag mark right there that will just kind of work with a little bit here. There's the, there's the end and here's the other end. I like them. I really like the way these work. And these are all natural. There's no fragrance in them. They're just honey beeswax soap. I have another video of how I actually made these that I'll put in the description box below so that you can see. See, these are a little darker, so these have gone through some gel phase here, and they may get darker as they sit as well. So, that is my honey beeswax soap, and it really is nice. It's a very, very luxurious bar of soap. And it's good for your skin. The honey actually helps with the humectancy of your skin so that it holds in the moisture. Now we're going to work with this piece. So I had made little teardrops the last time I made this, but I thought that I would go ahead and do this type of a mold. And I have some of those mats underneath. So we're going to take it out of there. Turn it upside down. And there are the mats. And then I'm just going to grab a hold of this and yank it up. I just love the look of that, even though it's not perfect. It just is so cool. I'm going to grab from the corner so I do the least amount of damage if I'm sticking my finger in there. And we got some of that red stuck. And then we have to cut it. So I'm pretty sure the last time I did this, I cut it like in two inch increments um, at one on one side and then I did half in the middle. I'm gonna go ahead and do the half point which is three inches. <laughs> Thank you.
It's pretty thick and harder to get through. Okay, we did it. Ta -da! It's kind of messed up there, but rearranging. There's two. I don't know what I'm doing. Do you know what I'm doing? I don't know what I'm doing. Now we have some honey beeswax soap available for your skin for this summer season.